Hey guys, excuse my lazy appeal, appeal, apparel, apparel. Excuse my lazy look because I've been sick this week and I want to be comfy. So I'm comfy, and I wanted to make a video for you guys this week. Still, um, there will not be an advice Friday, so heads up. But I still wanted to provide a video, so I decided to do the 25 facts about me. I've wanted to do this for a while, but I couldn't think of 25 facts. So I took time this morning and finally wrote down 25 facts. And now, I'll share them with you. Let's get started. Number one, for elementary and most of middle school, I refuse to use lead pencils. I don't know why, I just really liked my wooden pencils, I guess. But in about seventh grade, I think I decided finally that I would start using mechanical pencils. <laughs> Number two, I absolutely hate writing the capital letter Y. I don't know um, why, but it's pretty difficult to like do it for me. I've gotten better, and I know that sounds weird coming from someone my age, but I just I hate it. <laughs> so yeah. Number three, I came home from first grade telling my mother that I wanted to be a first grade teacher, and you know that still holds true to this day. Number four, this is my favorite number, no specific reason why, I just really like the number four. Number five, I absolutely despise oranges and orange juice. The smell and everything about them just ugh, keep them away from me. And yet, I'll eat orange starburst and Skittles. It's not real oranges. Number six, until this year, I had never been to Starbucks, never even walked into one. But now I kind of really, really love their hot chocolate. <laughs> Number seven. My favorite Disney princess would have to be Cinderella. It's been my favorite since I was little, and I think I'll always love Cinderella, no matter how many Disney princesses come out. Because one of my favorite quotes of all time is, A dream is a wish your heart makes. And who said that? Cinderella. Number eight. I have a blanket that I've had since I was three years old. Actually, this Christmas will mark 17 years since I received it. Yeah. If you can see it, right there, that is it. You get to see the nice looking part of it. It looks pretty rough, not gonna lie. Also, I called it Ginkin. Number nine. My favorite drink would have to be Dr. Pepper, hands down. I know it's very unhealthy and I try not to drink too much, but it's so good. Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> Number 10. Out of all the holidays, Thanksgiving is probably my favorite. I love spending time with family, family that I don't get to see often enough, and it's just, it's a nice holiday, and plus, food. Lots of it. <laughs> Number 11. The word dream would have to be my favorite word. Um, if you can see back there, it says dream in those mirrors. And yeah, throughout my room, you will see the word dream. It's just a favorite word, no particular reason why, I just really like it. 12. At the age of 12, I was diagnosed with JRA, also known as Juvenile Rheumatoid Arthritis. Don't you worry because I'm doing so much better than I was at that point. Number 13. I met Taylor Swift October 29, 2011, and here's a picture. 14. My celebrity crushes would have to be Cameron Keesing of The Tragic Thrills that I've met him five times, and also Josh Hutcherson. 15. I often write letters to my future self. I actually have a whole notebook full of letters that I have written to my future self and also my past self. I know my past self can't really benefit from it, but it's nice to like write down lessons I've learned. And I also have another section of the notebook that are like my current favorites, like favorite food, favorite snack, um, <laughs> it's all food. But, like favorite movie, favorite song, and it's just nice to look back on that. So. I would really suggest doing the same because I can't wait to look back many years from now and see what I wrote myself. 16. I both find stars and clouds a beautiful creation and both of them are just so lovely to look at and I could do it all day and all night. <laughs> 17. I could eat Chinese buffets fried rice probably all day every day because it is just so good and it's simple and it, it's yummy. Okay, I want some right now, so that probably inspired that fact. <laughs> so yeah. 18. I keep every fortune I ever receive from every fortune cookie. I don't know if you can see it. I believe it's right there. I have this coin bank that 
is of course supposed to be like a piggy bank to put money in and all that and it's a Chinese food takeout box that's what it looks like and I actually put my fortunes in there so yeah 19. Mr. Feeney from Boy Meets World has been a big part of my life because Boy Meets World is my favorite show of all time and if you look right there it says dream try and do good Mr. Feeney he has taught many life lessons that I will take to heart for the rest of my life. 20. Despite my young looks, I'm actually 20 years old. Yeah. Hard to believe, huh? 21. I tend to get a lot of clothes that have striped patterns or plaid. I don't know why, but I'm just drawn to them. I mean, I'm just like, ooh, I like that. And I'm like, it's stripes. It's plaid. But I really like them. 22. It's impossible for me to pick a favorite song of all time. I love music. Music is a big part of my life, but currently, I would have to say my favorite song is Pull Me In by John D. Definitely go check it out. It's an EP that he just put out, and it's his first original music, and I'm so proud of him. He's a fellow YouTuber as well. 23. I am only 5 foot tall and a fourth. Yes, that fourth counts. What are you talking about? 24. My senior quote was to infinity and beyond. Yes, Buzz Lightyear said that, but I am forever a kid at heart, so it fits. And 25. I have the same birthday as Harry Potter. Alright guys, that's it. Thank you for watching, and I'll be back hopefully next week and do maybe another video like this plus Advice Friday. But it's a holiday week, so it's hard to actually do one on Friday, but I hope you all enjoy this in its place. But as for now, I'll talk to you all later, and I hope you have a wonderful Thanksgiving if you celebrate. If not, eat food. It's fun. I love food. But I'll talk to you all later, and yeah, see you next time. Bye!